Hi guys, this is Nomadic Gamer. Welcome back to another episode of Stardew Valley, the second day of the first year. Advertisement. I keep finding cool stuff. My backpack is full. Does this sound like you? Well, Pierre's got you covered. Stop by Pierre's general store today and check out our affordable size 24 backpack. See you soon. Uh, the funny thing about that is that it's not affordable right now. It's like 10,000 gold or something crazy like that. Hello there, just got back from a fishing trip. You should come down to the beach sometime. I've got something for ya. Willie! Alright. Oh my gosh. When I first played this game, fishing was so f so fun to me so fun i loved it here is our little parsnips so right now we have to do everything by hand luckily there's a lake like right there I'm not exactly the best at, like, decorating, but I, I, I would like to do something cool. I would like to make things look spiffy and, and great, but I still have a lot of work to do least clear this out. And I may cut down some of these trees. Some of them I, I would dearly love to some of them I would dearly love to keep because Oh, that's right. Um, where was it? It was, it was, uh, one of the farms that I chose. And, yeah, like, the way was just constantly, it was blocked by, yeah. It was blocked by, by, um, one of these rocks or one of those, you know, one of these logs here. Tree stumps. But kind of just scouring the place, figuring out where to put things, where to put awesome things like, like barns for cows and chicken coops but we still we still need to find a lot of the people let's see to the beach I visit the beach before five introductions and still waiting on the parsnips There's a lot of people. Emily. Oh, I can read it on your face. You're going to love it here in Pelican Town. If you're ever looking for something to do in the evening, stop by the saloon. That's where I work. Why, hello, and welcome to our little community, dear. You can call me Granny if you like. <sighs> Jody. Oh, you aren't exactly how I imagined, but that's okay. I'm Jody. And the old lady was Evelyn. All right, Caroline, I'd like to put red mushroom on a chain. Please deliver it sometime today. A red mushroom. Don't think I can do that. Yep. Robin, 
Have you met everyone in town yet? That sounds exhausting. You have no idea, Robin. You have no idea. Yes, I remember, I, I would get so lost and I was constantly looking at the map. And I know where things are for the most part. Here's my farm right here. And there's the bus stop, the beach to the south, and the mines to the north. Ahoy there, miss. I heard there was a newcomer in town. Good to finally meet you. Ah, I'm still trying to unwind from a month out on the salty seas. It was a big haul. I sold a lot of good fish. Finally saved enough to buy me a new rod. Here, now you to have my old fishing rod. It's important to me that the art of fishing stays alive. And hey, maybe you'll buy something from the shop once in a while. Awesome. Bamboo pool. There's good water here in the valley. All kinds of fish. Oh yeah, my shop's back open now. So come by if you need supplies. I'll also buy anything you catch. And if it smells, it sells. <laughs> That's what my old pappy used to say anyway. See, at first, I was a little confused, but you have to keep the fish in the middle of that green bar. Got a herring! I got a sardine. And the fish can be sold. I usually just save the fish. And, uh, ooh, these statues. But I like how everything is, like, such a mystery. Ooh, somebody else. Ah, the new farmer we've all been expecting, and whose arrival has sparked many a conversation. I'm Elliot. I live in a little cabin by the beach. It's a pleasure to meet you. Hmm, with 300 pieces of wood, this could be fixed. But I like how everything is just such a mystery. And over here is the library. Oh, stranger, my name's Vincent. Mama says not to talk to strangers, but you seem okay. Hi. And... Penny! I'm tutoring Vincent and Jazz today. They're a handful, but it's nice to make a difference in someone's life. Hello there, welcome to the Stardew Valley Archaeological Office. Oh, this is embarrassing, but the previous curator made off with the entire collection. We don't have any artifacts for display, but I'm hoping. Mm, but I'm hoping to remedy that soon. Hey, if you find any artifacts or minerals out there, would you let me know? You can also read books. Try to. Oh gosh. 
That's clearly a book. <laughs> and I can't read it. But anyway, this is what the books do when there's something to read here, but it's not letting me. You go over here and there's just tables to fill and there's so many. I haven't I haven't yet filled, you know, uh, I haven't completed this entire little thing, but you know, that's another thing that I love. It's, it's this collection and collecting things. I love it. Er, hi, I'm Clint. I'm the town blacksmith. If you ever need to upgrade your tools, I'm your guy. He most certainly is. And upgrading, you need 2,000 gold and 5 copper bars. You can upgrade the hoe, the pickaxe, the watering can, and the axe. And upgrading these, it allows you to, um, like upgrading the axe, it allows you to take out those large tree stumps. You can also check in the trash. We'll get fiber anywhere. And this is only good for drinking and filling up your energy. That's it. It doesn't sell. I don't think it sells for anything. Or if it does, it's really super low to not matter. Hey, I'm Sam. Good to meet you. And there's Mayor Lewis again. So how was your first night in the old cottage? Your grandpa used to complain about the rickety old bed. But I think Dick Downey actually loved that house. I love Mayor Lewis. Hey, you're the new girl, huh? I think we're gonna get along great. I'm Alex. I'll see you around. Let me just follow Evelyn inside. <laughs> it's irritating to have to meet all these new people, huh? Name's George, by the way. Now buzz off. <laughs> I definitely think... Oh! Hey kid, my name's Pam. Don't be a jerk and we'll get along fine. Right back at ya. <laughs> oh, aren't you the one who just moved in? I'm Maru. I've been looking forward to meeting you. Aww. You know, with a small town like this, a new face can really alter the community, community dynamic. It's exciting. Yeah. It's also nice to um, to form connections and things. Um, yeah, I don't. Mm, I don't think he looks like a boy, but I feel like from the sides she kind of does. Um, I just wanted a cut that was like really that was short, kind of like a bob cut or whatever. Anyway. <laughs> hmm, nobody is here. Well, if Maru was heading back, I was hoping. Oh, he's, yeah. Stranger, hello. Don't mind me. I just live out here alone. Poor Linus. Oh, there you are. Oh, 
You just moved in, right? Cool. Out of all the places you could live, you just twilight. Oops. Pet Pelican Town. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh gosh. <sighs> anyway. Greetings, I'm Demetrius, local scientist and father. Thanks for introducing yourself. I'm studying the local plants and animals from my home laboratory. Have you met my daughter Maru? Yes. He's interested to meet you. Actually, let me head down. Hopefully I can make it in time. I'm not sure. I don't think that's Robin. Hello there, I'm Gus, chef and owner of the Stardrop Saloon. Please relax and enjoy yourself. Did I meet Emily? Yes. So how many does that make? Introductions. Missing six people. Yeah, time definitely goes by pretty quickly. But, at least I have some fish to sell, and they sell pretty nicely. And definitely when I had the, um... Do the seeds sell? I don't know if they sell. Alright. Oh dear. Um right. Right, right, right. Gave me was fiber. Okay. Now let's see if this lake has any fish in it. Okay, driftwood. And all of the stuff. Yes! Got a carp. Fantastic. I want to keep the driftwood. Right. Hundred gold. All right. Yeah. Mixed seeds don't sell for anything. All right. Well, it sold the most was the sardine. 
All right, um, that's gonna have to be the episode. Um, yeah, I, I forgot, I forgot that, that this is how, you know, uh, you can save your game and start your valley. So I think each episode will simply be a single day in the game. So next episode will be day three. So if you enjoyed, click that like button, subscribe for more Stardew Valley, and I will see you next time. Bye. Run away, run away, and I know, and I know, and I know I'm right now. We can change anything and make it better. Together now we're strong, don't question it. The truth will break your chains, we have the key.